So this is a study that uh, we performed, uh, uh, that we have published uh, uh, in the last two years uh, in epilepsy. Um, and then there is a, a meta-analysis that uh, has been published this year in neurosurgery on the same topic. So the first study was a, a multi-center Italian study, nationwide study, when we retrospectively uh, uh, analyzed the outcome and the characteristics of temporal lobe uh, epilepsy in uh, children versus adults. And what we found that is these are completely different groups. There are different characteristics, clinical and uh, characteristics also from the point of view of etiology, and the outcome was better in children than in adults. And then we performed this year a um, systematic review and meta-analysis uh, when we uh, assessed uh, more than 200 uh, papers from all over the world uh, on this topic, uh, temporal lobe epilepsy surgery in children and adults. And again, we found uh, differences between these two groups. And even if differences in outcome between children and adults were not significant, however, we could assess that children perform better. So the, um, the results for the, the conclusions for both studies is that uh, it's important to uh, operate patients as soon as possible. So as children, uh, and not at, and not wait uh, 30 years because now for adults it's a 30 years the duration of epilepsy before surgery so it's too much we have to break these patients as soon as possible first uh, the duration of epilepsy that is shorter uh, then the etiologies because uh, very often in uh, children you find small lesions that is uh, small lesions or well-defined lesions that is uh, easier to uh, remove then uh, there is the plasticity of the children's brain, so you can perform larger sections uh, because you are less afraid about the consequences of the uh, operation. And then there is uh, something that we are not understanding, probably uh, the construction of the network is uh, much uh, uh, more complicated in adults than in children. And so uh, it's not um, always possible to completely resect the epileptogenic zone. So, uh, no, no, and not all the reasons are uh, well understood. Uh, we should need, we need uh, for prospective studies, but uh, this is very difficult to uh, carry on because uh, usually prospective studies in epilepsy surgery are not funded. So it's very complicated to perform a multi-center study on this topic. However, we have the results of several meta-analysis systematic review, all uh, saying that we have to create these patients as soon as possible.